Hey everyone, in this video, we're going to build a very practical and easy to make water level indicator. This system is designed to help you avoid unnecessary water wastage by clearly showing the exact level of water inside your tank. This indicator can save a lot of time and prevent overflow issues. The best part is that the entire project is extremely simple to assemble and even beginners can make it without any difficulty. And make sure you stay with me till the end of the video because the complete testing of this water level indicator will be shown in the final section right at the end. JLCPCBSMT service is certainly the best choice for assembling your PCBs. With the cutting edge technology, they can save both your time and money, ensuring highest quality. In fact, they assemble electronic products from PCB design to PCB air products on the same online platform, which is very convenient for the customers. JLCPCB also establishes a well-trained engineers, customer support team, which is very handy and helpful. Ordering SMT service is quite easy at link to JLCPCB.com. First, you need to upload the Gerber file. Turn on the SMT assembly button and confirm. Go next and check out with preferred shipping method. If you want to order SMT service with high quality and low cost, check the link in the description below. I've personally ordered multiple PCBs from them and every single time, the quality has been outstanding neat finish, accurate solder mask and fast delivery right at my doorstep. JLCPC Black Friday sale is now live. Every user can get up to in $650 PCB, 3D printing, CNC machining, mechatronic parts, Stencils and more. Unlock your saving at JLC, the one stop manufacturing platform. Link to JLCPCB.com. Claim now. $650 coupon be the first. Let's move to the making process. The very first components we've used are five LEDs, which will act as level indicators, and 547 transistors and 1K resistor. These are simple parts, but they play a very important role in sensing the water level and controlling the LEDs. We'll start placing every component carefully on the board, and it's extremely important to set them in the correct direction. The exact orientation that I'm showing you, make sure you follow the same. If any component is placed in the wrong direction, the circuit simply won't work. So take your time, match the direction, and fix every part properly in place. And friends, all the PCB projects I've built so far were fully designed and ordered through JLCPCB, their service provides high-quality, perfectly finished PCBs. Back to the main point, we'll begin the soldering process. The soldering needs to be done slowly and neatly so that none of the components become loose from their position. Make sure the joints are clean, shiny, and firmly bonded to the pads. And friends, let me tell you something interesting about this particular design. Inside this circuit, you don't need any external wires for the sensing section because I already designed a built-in sensor pattern from the JLCPCB website. Friends, you can make this project even more advanced. For example, when the water tank gets full, this system instantly triggers a buzzer to alert you. And yes, I've already created a water tank alarm circuit in one of my previous videos, but this time I've upgraded it to be smarter, safer and more reliable. This compact design is super useful for everyday home use and helps prevent water overflow without any hassle. And friends, now we'll use a simple hanger clip. Just apply a little instant glue and firmly attach it. This small addition will hold everything neatly in place and make the setup more stable. So with all the components placed correctly, the soldering complete and the internal sensor design ready, our water level indicator circuit assembly is now finished and ready for testing. For the testing process, we're using a simple power bank. Let's connect it to our PCB and now the circuit is fully active. As soon as I start pouring water into the water jar, notice what happens. The moment the water touches the first sensor point, the indicator light immediately turns on. The response is quick, accurate, and truly helpful for preventing water wastage. For now, that's all for today's video. I'll see you in the next one. Till then, bye-bye, take care and lots of love.